What's up everyone, the Alchemical Jackalope here, also known as the uh, Alchemical Gamer! And today I have something very special for you guys. I'm going to do two things in the same video. I'm going to introduce my EDC, or Everyday Carry. And that's actually something that I got inspired to do by Tenji Arizona, the angry Dracolope of the Jackalope crew. Which I'm also part of, the Dra the Jackalope crew. Get, get a lope on! So, now, let's begin with my everyday carry. Though it was lately updated, because I haven't been carrying around uh, the usual stuff that's hanging on it now. Uh, let's begin as usual. I got the tag to my home. A badge that allows them to track who the owner is to the key chain and all. Then my house key and the key to the garage. Then at the end of the chain. We have the key to uh, the place where, I l where I'm actually working. Um, then I have a poop emote con. <coughs> and then we actually have <coughs> this um, hook thing, I can't remember what it's called. On which I have a shopping trolley uh, coin. The the key to a letter box here, where I live. An old key to uh, one of the bikes that my family has. Some spare keys to uh, a bike lock. And then we actually have something that Tenshi Arizona probably will enjoy, which I will actually use in the unboxing. Put that thing aside. And it's actually. <coughs> focus your fuck. It's actually a small Swiss, Swiss army knife. So, comes with the standard stuff. Mind you, this is really small, so I have to use a pair of tweezers to actually. Uh, this thing open. So, we have. Uh, the usual miniature scissors. <clears throat> then we have what I would guess is some kind of um, file or something. I can't remember what it's called. And then, of course, we have <coughs> the blade. A really, really small knife and this is actually this actually belonged to my cousin who sadly passed away a few years ago so I decided to take care of it but now it's actually gonna be put to use so you might be wondering now that my EDC is actually taken care of what am I exactly unboxing well, uh, I got a package today, and it's not a small package, to be honest. <laughs> it's actually 46 times 34 times 22. So, roughly 33 liters. So, what exactly can I actually have ordered? Well, I'm gonna give you a hint. It has something to do with gaming. And it came uh, quite a bit out of my own uh, savings. But from what I've seen on YouTube videos and such, it's actually quite useful 
in the gaming community since it opens up a ton of possibilities and given that I've actually had experience with uh, with this kind of stuff when I was visiting an expo here in uh, well in the capital city of Stockholm it actually cured me of my acrophobia I might as well have spoiled a little too much what it can be if you're uh, putting acrophobia and something to do with gaming so uh, this would ruin it <laughs> so what can it actually be? Well, I gotta put this box on my floor. Ow! Ah, oh, my toe. <laughs> it's a heavy box. Everyone knows about the orange box. <laughs> but. Now we're taking care of the black box. A lot of a lot of bubble wrap. I'm gonna have a lot ton of fun with that thing. So, you guys ready? Oh, it's the HTC Vive. Yeah, VR set. So yeah. Okay, apparently I I didn't realize that I was supposed to have uh, used this one uh, more. This has a safety a safety thing here. Don't you do it? Throw that in the trash. Might as well have this on standby just in case. Whoa! Okay, I, I really like this box. Talk about a real unboxing! Okay, g get started. Huh. This is really neat, to be honest. They have an envelope right up here. This has to be the instruction manual. Hmm. Let's see what it actually says here. Um, two meters, one and a half meter. The minimum size of the room. And five meters between the base base stations. For uh, if I if I want to use it at max, standing seated. Huh. Yeah, it's a ton of stuff for this thing. But yeah. So yeah. We have a ton of stuff to really go through with this thing. <laughs> ah. The vibe itself. Uh, gonna have some serious fun with this thing. <laughs> Might as well put this one uh, to uh, away for the moment. Huh. Neat speakers or something. This, huh. actually, there's two. I 
guess new speakers probably could be sensors. I'm not really familiar with all of this. Controllers. Ah, <sighs> really gets me nostalgical. <sighs> Standing there at the expo with with these, so I could walk out over that building and just jump. I have to tell you, it felt so real, but it was so good to actually uh, do it. <laughs> it really gave a sense of dread, but at the same time it felt really good. Oh boy, there's a ton of things to uh, set up here. Some kind of connector. Oh boy. This means I gotta have a lot of time to really set the thing up. I might set it up today or I might set it up tomorrow, but I gotta be sure to really set it all up. Some kind of isolation thing. Huh. Power cable. More cables. Uh, some kind of thing I don't even know what it is. I guess I'm just gonna have to uh, keep you guys updated because it seems like I have a ton to read up on. Uh, and that was just one part of it. Huh. Mounting base guide? Huh. <sighs> Well, one thing is one thing is for sure. They are not sparing any uh, any technological thing, or they don't spare any things that you need to set up. Huh? Use the code below to redeem a content bundle for your wife. Huh? Might as well do it at some point. Put it under the screen. More cables. More cables. More cables. More cables. More cables. But that's actually that's actually the last. I basically unpacked everything already. Uh, gonna be a ton of fun to uh, gonna gonna be a ton of fun when uh, this is set up. So <coughs> let's put this bad boy aside. <sighs> okay then. So I'm just gonna lay these down here and flip the. Knife shot so I don't end up cutting myself. But what did you guys think of the unboxing and am I E to Z? Feel free to comment in the comment section below. Maybe give a suggestion what you want to see me using the Vive for once I'm actually done with setting it up. And make sure to give a like and 
comment and maybe subscribe because I always enjoy having more moon beasts watching the moon with me. So, until next time, the moon may hide the beast in shadow by my of salvation. So, see you guys here in the next moon phase. I'm the alchemical jackalope and the alchemical gamer. Keep the chem, keep the chemlope going.